race highlights of race number two of the ASB Superbike 1000 CC race. Andy Farad is the heart, is the championship leader coming into this race, but look at the start made by Yuki Kuni and Sho Nishimura. Sho a wild card in, Yuki Kuni for SDG Hard Pro, but y Yuki within the first lap had taken the lead and we wouldn't see anybody catch him. Passawind went out early, Osama went out early, Minimamoto had all kinds of problems holding on to the back end, but no problems up the front for Yuki Kuni, Barry Russell. Yeah, so Chiro recovered well. Yuki Kuni did what he needed to do, and he didn't do yesterday, which was make that good start. He was in front a couple of corners later. Shonishimura chased hard. He had more pace at this stage than Hafiz Shirin. We, uh, we yeah. focused a little bit on Chip Nakarin because of his exploits yesterday. It looked like he would have to settle for a P6 or even worse because there was so much going on. But, of course, racing, things can change very, very quickly. Not for Cooney. He would continue to lead and dominate. But for Sho Nishimura, there would be a big problem. We're just beyond the midway point of the race here. Again, we're looking at mid, uh, midway through. Yeah. Chiro Minamoto is holding on. Chip Nakarin begins to make his move now. But Nishimura would crash out, and that would change everything. Yeah, and there he is in the gravel. That meant absolutely nothing to the rider in front. A long way back was Hafiz Sharin for JDT, but that put him into a comfortable place, and especially comfortable in championship terms as well as we would see later. Then Chip Nakarin had moved his way up into P3. He got ahead of Andy Farid. He got ahead of Aslan Shah. Aslan Shah would bravely hold on to P4, but Chip Nakarin would uh, soon be able to celebrate a P3. As we come into the final lap, yeah, the first two are miles, miles clear. The Honda and the Ducati, this is the real battle. Minimamoto not a million miles away from getting a podium. Neither was Aslan Shah. There's the mistake from the championship leader, Andy Farid. That could cost him dear at the end of the season. But Yuki Kuni comes through. It was a it was a brilliant performance and something I think we expected all weekend, Barry. Yeah, we did. We didn't get it yesterday. We got it today. Uh, Andy Farid, rare mistake from him on the last lap. And look what that means to Yuki Kuni as he crosses the line. But our championship leader is this man, Hafiz Sharin Abdullah from JDT Racing. The celebrations may well be for Yuki Kuni, but the biggest win.